So of recent, um, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra got his freedom and uh, the court acquitted and freed him. But Malami on DSS has refused to let him go. In the first news, I have that Malami refused to let Mazinam Bikanu go because he believes that the court did not do their job well. The National Security Council on Friday said it was backing the position of the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Ababa Kamalami, over the appeal court judgment on the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Nandi Kano, that debunked his complete acquittal. Minister of Police Affairs, Mohammed Binyadi, disclosed this to State House correspondent shortly after the NSC meeting presided over by the President Major General Mohammed Buhari at Asurok. Dingyadi, who spoke alongside his counterpart in the Ministry of Interior, Roof, Arigba Sola, said Kanu was only discharged, even as the government would now exploit other legal instruments to pursue the matter. However, he noted that the council did not discuss a possible political solution which Malami had raised last November. The council, he said, only discussed the appeal court judgment but noted that solution to such matter could be considered so far as they were not subjudiced. Now, you see, the the big problem here in the picture is that, okay, before I continue, I want to uh, welcome my new followers. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? This is the first time I'm coming across the thank you. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share, do not forget to follow us. If you're returning follower, may God bless you and bless you massively. Thanks for supporting us. We're already heading to 1,000. Hundred subscribers. God bless you guys. So, uh, there was a report that um, on Thursday said the federal government may consider any route, including political, to resolve the crisis surrounding IPUB's agitation. Fielding questions on Kano and other separatist agitators on the board, the AGF said, as far as the security situation is concerned, and as far as governance and the administration is concerned, you cannot rule out all possibilities. The biggest fact remains that Malami has refused to release Nandi Kano. And uh, just like what people said, that Malami is already doing something that will not matter. It will not matter to him after life. So trying to keep Mazin Nandi Kano in prison when the court of law has said that uh, Nandi Kano should be freed is a big no. Is a big, big, big no. So, I think Malami should come to consideration and do the needful and stop holding in an innocent man who the court has freed. Of course, Mazin Amdikano was tagged a terrorist. <laughs> of course, he was tagged a terrorist, and uh, the court has looked into the case. Even the 15 court charges have been disowned and discharged. Let me know what you guys think about Namdikano's case and why Malami and DSS has refused to let him go. I love you guys. Let me see your comments in the comment section. Do not forget to subscribe. Peace out.